He wasn't the toxic whale that he is now. He was a good man. Whale. Whale. Not good, though, for the rotting whale carcass that's down at 13th Beach. Good segue. Ah, yeah. oh, thanks. That was good. It just, can you imagine being downwind or your house a few blocks from this beach and then going, oh, did you, is the lid on the bin? What's going on there? Ah, oh, yeah. it's a giant whale carcass. The giant whale. Well, so mm. there's been there's been a, a petition signed and all that. I think they've got over two thousand five hundred odd signatures. Mm. Mm. But you know to remove the carcass, what yeah. do you what do, you, do they tie it up and tow um, it out to sea and let the the great whites have at it, or what's I the vibe? Well, I reckon they might try and roll it back into the ocean. But the problem is that it attracts sharks. Yeah, and a lot of sharks to the area. All I can think of when you ask me that is the Family Guy episode where there's a whale on the beach and Peter Griffin, the father, goes down with a forklift and tries to roll it, but just keeps stabbing it with the place <laughs> of the... Anyway. Bit of a funeral as well before they get rid of it? I don't know. I think may, maybe not. I mean, who does the ceremony? Who does the eulogy? I will. What's the hymn? All right. Well, yeah, okay. So we're at the we're at the whale ceremony now. Like, do you want to yeah. say a couple of words? Yeah, I'd love to uh, yeah. start off by saying it's um yeah it's been a uh, it's been a horrible time. Yeah, um, we've lost this whale, and uh, Darren, <laughs> the whale, and uh, what a life he lived. <laughs> I hope everyone can remember Darren for what he was. He wasn't the toxic whale that he is now. He was a good man. Whale. Whale. Mel, would you like to say a few words? Yeah, um, Darren and I grew up together and I feel very sad and it stinks and so does he. The end. Mel and Nick in the morning on Bay 93.9.